I've been playing around with the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 for a little while now, and it has been an experience since I've purchased this thing. A lot of people will end up buying this item right here. If you haven't already ordered you one, I'm pretty sure you're gonna be looking to order you one of these in the future, especially if you're a content creator. I had to get my hands on this thing, especially because it shoots in 4K 60 frames per second. And look at how small this thing is. Like this literally is a full pocket camera. You can pretty much do anything that you wanna do with this. I kept watching YouTube videos of this camera and man, I just had to get my hands on it. So funny story, I actually sold my Sony FX3 to buy this camera. Now I know y'all probably in the comments like, man, this guy is a idiot for doing that. But at the same time, this camera right here was only $672 and that's including shipping and taxes. And the combo that I have is called the creator combo, which comes with Osmo Pocket 3, the microphone and a bunch of other accessories. So it's not a bad deal for $672. Now, y'all know the FX3 is a full frame mirrorless camera and it's also a cinema line basically full scale video camera. You can do so many things on the FX3, it's not even funny, but the FX3 is a $3,500 camera. So this is definitely a great alternative to go with, especially if you do vlogging content. That's more so the targeted audience that they have for this, pretty much the content creators and vloggers who wanted to have something that you can kind of conceal. The quality on this thing is crazy. So since I've been playing around with this thing for the last two weeks, I'm not sure where this idea came from. I think I was literally just going through my camera bag and I pretty much just came up with a Jimmy rig type of rig at this point. That's what I'm gonna call it. This is just some Jimmy rig stuff that I kind of threw together. I've used this for the past week or two since I've had this camera and it has been a game changer. It's only three things to complete this rig super easy setup but it is crazy efficient i'm not gonna lie to y'all at all iphone android either one is fine android you'll have to go through a little bit more steps to actually get this to work but with the iphone it's super simple so iphone and then of course your dji osmo you definitely need that because you're not going to be able to record or do any type of content without your camera. It just don't work like that. So yeah, make sure you got your camera, cool. And then last but not least, I have this right here. This is the magic, the magic piece to the puzzle that you really, really need to make this thing work how you want it to. I actually have a phone mount right here that is able to be unscrewed. So you can unscrew it from here. This particular part right here is from Small Rig. Small rig makes a bunch of different camera accessories and they're really good quality. So again, it's a two part, a two piece part right here. This here is just a regular old phone mount that you can find on Amazon or Walmart for probably like five to $10. It ain't gonna burn your pockets. I forgot what this piece is called, but I will go ahead and list it down below in the description. I'm gonna just go ahead and put this back together. So all you do, super simple, man. This is the most simplest rig that you probably could ever come across. So you just go ahead and screw that in the bottom. So now you can pretty much hold it like this. Next thing you're gonna do is just screw your phone mount on. So I'm gonna go ahead and screw my phone mount on there, just like that. This is probably the best one that I've came across cause I know I had two of these extension arms and one of them just was not good at all. So I ended up buying this one. I kind of wasted my money on that one, but hey, what else to do with money if not waste it, honestly? But yeah, next thing, just take your phone and go ahead and open that bad boy up like that and voila. It don't get no better than this guy. It doesn't get any better than this right here. A cheap, super efficient way to do your videography and to do your cinematography or whatever you are into and whatever you can create with the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Also, if you untwist this a little bit, it'll loosen the screen up so you can use your phone as a field monitor. That's the purpose of this. And you can also move this around. So you can rotate it however you want to. You can kind of tilt it up if you need to and then tilt that straight and all you have to do is just tighten it up. So now you pretty much have a full scale film monitor.
full scale field monitor right here, guys. And everything works. The way that you make this work is that you want to go into the DJI uh, Mimo app. You can download this from the app store. It's totally free. You won't have to spend none of your hard earned bread. Yeah, go ahead and go to the DJI Mimo app. Connect to your Osmo Pocket 3, which is what I'm doing now. And once this thing, once this thing connects, which it just did, so it is connected. And I'm gonna go ahead and reset that gimbal. And boom, this is what we have right here. And it looks really, really good. Like I said, you can use it like this. And you can also, great thing about the DJI Memo app is you can control every single control on this camera through your phone screen. So not only is it a field monitor, it is also an external control for your DJI Osmo Pocket 3. So that being said, you can change the exposure on here. You can change the shooting settings. You can change the, the uh, frame rate that you want to shoot in. You can change the uh the the shutter speed you can pretty much change everything through this app while you are recording not while you are recording but you can pretty much change everything through this app and it will change the settings on your dji osmo pocket 3. so that being said i me personally i think that this right here is gonna change the content creation game and just the, the the videography game in general you probably will see somebody doing a full music video with just this setup that i'm showing y'all right here right now and that's crazy right because people usually rock around with the, the big old dji rs's the dji rs3 or rs2 pros big bulky setup is heavy as hell and trust me i know because i have one in my house right now that i use almost on a daily basis so it's heavy as hell Versus this right here is only about two to three pounds. And hey, man, this Osmo Pocket will definitely have you surprised. I'm not going to lie to y'all on that one. This Osmo Pocket 3 will have y'all ready to sell y'all's camera like I did. I can literally pull three things out of my pocket and record a whole movie if I want to. Like, you know what? Maybe I'll record a scary movie tonight. I don't know. I'm going to just pull my phone out wherever I am and just, just record me a movie, man. Because... That's literally what you can do with something like this. And it's so crazy how technology has advanced to the point where you can literally have such a simple setup like this and it'll just be able to do so much. So yeah, this is the rig that I was trying to do a video for for the last week or so. And I finally got this video out. Hopefully y'all enjoy it and hopefully y'all actually use this method and make some good content. I don't know what y'all think, but hey, I'm gonna be using this for sure. But with that being said, subscribe to the channel turn your post notifications on that's pretty much all for today i'm gonna go ahead and get me some video footage in with this thing and i'll catch y'all later we out